Ms. Levin, speaking to Talk TV's Julia Hartley Brewer, said she believes Camilla will choose another crown in spite of her husband's wishes as the Queen Consort is keen not to create problems with India while the UK government is negotiating a trade deal with them. Foreign Secretary James cleverly said on Thursday morning that the decision over whether to wear the crown containing the gem will be left to the palace. Ms. Levin, King Charles would like Camilla to wear that. I'm quite sure that she doesn't mind. She can choose any one of 40 tiaras. But, they feel this might affect the deal they are doing with India and that is very important at the moment because everything is so tricky now. Miss Hartley Brewer said, I would have thought, with all the problems facing India and all the other countries around the world, that what some lady on the other side of the world is wearing is the least of their problems. Ms. Levin said, King Charles does really want her to do this but I am quite sure she will choose another one. The government has said it is down to Buckingham Palace to decide whether the controversial Koh-i-Noor diamond should be used in the coronation of the Queen Consort. The governing party of Indian Prime Minister Narendra Modi is reported to have expressed concern that the famous gem, which was seized by the East India Company and given to Queen Victoria in the 19th century, would provide an unwelcome reminder of the British Empire. Foreign Secretary James cleverly said, ultimately, decisions like that are for the palace. The palace is really very good at assessing the public, and indeed the international mood. He added, we have a fantastic relationship with India and the Indian people. It is a decision for the palace and I have no doubt the coronation will be an absolute celebration.
Thank <laughs> you.